This is Pulse for Pioneer DJ, and this is a video for how to record multiple channels of audio when using a DJM 900 Nexus 2 with a Mac. Whether you're using hardware, software, or a combination thereof, the DJM 900 Nexus 2 is capable of recording 12 channels of audio, so you can capture your post fader audio for mix down later. For this video, we'll be using Audacity, which is a free software available for both Mac and PC. You can download it from audacity.sourceforge.net. Before we start, make sure that you have the latest drivers and firmware for your mixer. Then, when you're ready, open Audacity and create a new session. You'll also want to open up the DJM 900 Nexus 2 setting utility. I've configured my mixer output for channels 1, 2, 3, and 4 all to send their post faders to the respective USB outputs. The 910 is reserved for the mix out, so you have a copy of your mix down. And be sure to set your USB output level to a level that's appropriate for your computer and your signal level. If you're hot on the mixer, you might want to adjust this down to a lower level. I use minus five as I maintain my mixer levels around the zero dB mark. Once you've got that set, you can close it, and now you're ready to start recording. Press the red recording button and all of your tracks will appear. Press play on your decks, take up your channel faders, and now you'll see the audio recording within the software. Channels one and two are for the left XDJ1000 on channel one, and channels seven and eight are the right XDJ on channel four. Channels nine and 10 are a mix of the master output, which you can see is affected by the audio being fed to it. I've left channels three, four, five, and six open as I have those coming from software. Once I begin playback here, you'll see recording audio coming through into the software as well. Keep in mind that your master recording level will get pretty hot if you have four channels running at the same time. When you're finished recording, click the stop button, and now you're ready to save your audio project or export the audio for use in the mix down later. That's it, pretty easy to record a whole bunch of channels of discrete audio post fader with the DJM 900 Nexus 2. If you have any other questions, Hit us up on the forums, forums.pioneerdj.com.